Hi, uh, my name is Trent Ferris. I work in Prime's Road Assist Department, and today I'm going to show you how to jumpstart a reefer. This is one of the things that we cover in the Prime Maintenance 1.0 class. So if you're interested in learning about this and some other things to um, help on the maintenance side, uh, get with your fleet manager or your Road Assist advisor, and uh, we'll get you routed in to take this class. So um, first of all, this reefer doesn't have any doors on it. Normally it would have a door right here that you would um, just open the door up. The reefer battery is right here um, on the outside of the unit. Um, so you're gonna take your uh, red side of your cable and put it on the red post, which is gonna be on the back. And it's gonna be a little tight. So get it on there and then take your black post. Before you put your black post on, make sure your other side of your cable, um, the, the, the uh, clampers are not touching each other. So put your black post on, and then you're gonna go to your truck side on the back of your cab on your jumper posts and do the same thing. Put your red uh, clamper on your, your red post and your black on your black. Um, if your truck does not have a black post, you can just put the black one on the tractor frame. You're going to want to give it at least 30 minutes, preferably closer to one hour to charge before you try and start the reefer up. One last thing, when you get finished, make sure and put your rubber boot back on the positive jumper post. Uh, thank you so much for watching.